In this video, I'm gonna tell you how you can get paper cash from your cash card at an ATM. And at the end, I'm gonna tell you a trick on how you can also do it for free. So stick around for that. So before you head to an ATM, make sure that you understand the fees associated with ATMs with the cash card. For most of us, Cash App is gonna charge a $2 fee for each withdrawal at an ATM but that's also in addition to whatever the ATM owner charges. And since there's no network of free ATMs with the cash card, pretty much all of them are gonna charge you a fee. And that could range from about two to $5. Also make sure that you're aware of the limits on using ATMs with the cash card. You are limited to $1,000 per seven day period. And that includes all transactions at an ATM or if you use it as a debit card for cash back at a store. So let's go over what you need before you can use an ATM with the Cash App. You're definitely going to need a card. If you don't already have one, you can order it in the app. You're gonna open up Cash App and you go to the second tab here, we'll show you your card. If you already have a card, it'll show, show it here. And if you need to order one, it'll show you how to do that here. If you need to do anything with your pin, you will go into this menu right here. Pin change is down here, or you can also enable your card here if it was shut off. It needs to be enabled before you can use it at an ATM. Also, before you head to the ATM, you should check and make sure that you have enough money in your account. To find out how much money is in your Cash App account, you go to this first tab right here, and that'll show you your balance. When you use an ATM, you cannot withdraw more than you already have in your Cash App balance. If you need to add more money to your account, I have a separate video about four ways that you can add money to your account, but the basic way is pressing this button, Add Cash, right Right here, which is going to take it from your linked debit card. Since the Cash App card is a Visa debit card, it does work at basically any ATM. When you get to the ATM, you're going to walk up and insert your card. You're going to enter your Cash App pin, and then you're going to select withdrawal or get cash. If the ATM asks you which type of account that you want to use checking your savings, it doesn't matter which one you choose because there's only one account associated with your Cash App card it'll go to it either way. Then you're gonna enter how much money you want to withdraw from the ATM. You should get a warning in here about how much the ATM owner is going to charge you. Then you're gonna take your money and take your card and be on your way. Cash App gave me a notice right away that I withdrew $25 from my account. Of course, I only actually got $20 from the ATM because I had $5 in fees. Since I don't like to carry a bunch of cards around, I was wondering if I could use an ATM with my cash card without the card with me. Could I have it on my Google Pay app on my phone and use that at the ATM? Well, I found out there's lots of ATMs that have contact list options, but it seems like none of them work with Cash App. I tried it at Bank of America, US Bank, and Chase Bank. They all had contact list options, but all of them denied the Cash App card when I tried to use it with Google Pay. I'm not sure if it's Cash App that doesn't allow it or if it's the ATM owners that doesn't allow it, but it doesn't work. It was pretty expensive to take cash out at an ATM with my cash card. It cost me $25 to get $20. But thankfully, there are other ways that you can do it that are free. One of the easiest options is to use your cash card to check out at a store that allows cash back. And then you can just choose cash back when you pay with your card and get your cash that way. That is completely free. But do be aware that that does count towards your ATM and debit maximum for the day and for the week. There is another way that you can avoid having any of these ATM fees with a cash card, and that's by setting up direct deposit. If you have direct deposits that equal $300 per month, you're gonna get free ATMs for that whole month. Cash App will not charge you a fee, and whatever fees are charged by the ATM owner will be refunded to you from Cash App. They do have a maximum of three fee refunds per month though. Next up, check out my video where I show you four different ways that you can add money to your Cash App account, including one that's brand new. 